So as I was saying, there is an indefinite and effective process in retaining direction given to you as an actor. Okay, so first you hear the direction, then you reflect the direction back to your coach, they confirm it, and then you apply it to the scene, and this is what we'll be doing today. Sounds easy. Great. So I will be giving straight to the point, easy direction, so no need to overthink it. Just focus on the notes. You all been working on your scenes for a couple weeks now, so breathe and let's have some magic happen. Okay? Ready? Mother Gibbs, George and I turned that farm into just about the best place you ever saw. And we thought of you all the time. We wanted to show you the new barn and the great long cement drinking fountain that we got for the stock. We got it out of the money you gave us. Mm. Don't you remember, Mother? The legacy that you left us? Why, it was over $350. They put a patent device in the drinking fountain now, so it never goes up, it never goes down. It's fine. <laughs> Just, I know it's not going to be the same as George without me. Why people don't understand, do they? They're sort of just like shut up in these little boxes. I feel like I know them. Mother Gibbs, when does this feeling go away? Being one of them, how how long does it stay? I never realized before. Just how troubled and in the dark life persons are. Good morning tonight. That's all they are. Troubled. Great, okay, great jumping off point. You know, you brought something so specific, yet so vague at the same time. You know, I just want to remind you that this character of Emily, although she's filled with darkness, she's also brimming with the light of a thousand stars. You know? Overall, your read was too yellow for me. I would encourage you to use a palette of like white, red, blue, velvet, or velvet textures. That's great too. You know, and I really, I really liked your physicality, like the, the hunchback, you know, but it's just, it's not how I pictured it. You know, I just, I wish you would bring your whole self into the role. But remember, you're playing a character who is inherently not you, so leave your whole self at home, okay? To sum up, I want you to be big, but like so petite, so like lose some weight, just like, just a little bit little, okay? Like be, like be so vocal, but like I barely want to hear you. Your, your character's shooting for the moon, but it has like barely left the ground because she's a mid-jump, you know? Beautiful. No, repeat those, repeat those notes back to me, please. Uh... You know what? It's great. It's class. We'll, 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 we'll work on it. But it's our last class. Can I have a water? 